good evening maybe and welcome to my channel i'm dr jayashree mahajan today is my topic is on how you know or how you can get the baby boy or girl what is the criteria as it science says anything about it i'm going to explain now to you okay so let's see my topic or watch it till the end okay first of all when the when the conception take place at that time only the gender of the baby is decided okay matlab is it you are going to deliver a baby boy or baby girl it is only and only decided at the time where is fertilization take place okay the sperm when meet the egg at the time it's the time of fertilization only at that time there is fixed is it you are going to deliver a baby boy or baby girl so if the y chromosome y chromosome contribute to the sperm then you are delivering to a baby boy if the x chromosome is contribute to the sperm then you are going to deliver a baby girl okay and this is the one thing ki when the fertilization take place at that time only the it is fixed ki you are going to deliver a baby boy or baby girl second most thing when you can diagnose it you can diagnose by sonography at that time when you are 12 to 13 weeks by sonographically you can see is it a baby boy or girl but today today is era when mtb act has become very very strict so you can't diagnose it okay and it is a very punishable act if you diagnose it by sonographically or any other method and you drop your pregnancy so it has become a criminal law mtb act has become very strict so guys please don't do it okay but there is one scientific theory which decided is that you are going to deliver a baby boy or a girl so it might help you to deliver a boy or girl baby so what is it i'm going to explain it it is not 100% proven but it is almost 50 to 70% proven so let's know it okay first i want to tell you the characters of the sperms the character of the sperms y sperm and x sperm what are they you know what what did uh, if you are going to deliver a baby boy or girl it is only depend on your male partner because the y chromosome are the important for the baby of a male child okay and it's only having to the male partner so it is only depend on the male partner not on the female partner so whatever whatever the misconception in this today's area about the ladies it's all are false so if you want to blame any born you can blame for the baby girl or boy baby so you can blame your male partner okay but to blame anyone it is not right so don't blame anybody another thing is what uh yeah x chromosome and y chromosome x chromosome are very very uh strong and they are very slow if on the side y chromosome they are very fast but they are very very fragile very weak okay so this two characteristic of that chromosomes help to get the gender of the baby okay how it is so let's know okay first of all uh if you want a baby boy you have to do a uh, intercourse just at the time of ovulation when your ovulation if your ovulation is take place on the 14th day you just have to keep the contact on the only 14th day not prior to that not after to that why is it so because when your ovulation take place adds the y chromosome are more fast and they are as they are fast they will just speedily just run toward the eggs and they can fertilize the egg and you can get the baby boy okay and vice versa that if you want to be be girl you have to do intercourse just 4 5 days before ovulation at least 3 4 days before ovulation why did so because if you want to be be girl 
three four days before if you do a intercourse you have started the intercourse your all y sperm are heavily uh they are very speedy so they will run and they will just die off at the time of ovulation so at the time of ovulation only y sperm can reach the egg okay because they can life they have the more life y chromosome have the less life and uh, x chromosome have the more life so in 3 4 days this all the y chromosome will die and only the x chromosome are will be there for to fertilize the egg so you will get the baby girl okay this is the one scientific criteria which decided the if you are going to deliver a baby boy or baby girl it is only 50 to 70% proven not 100% another most thing uh, intercourse penetration is also one thing if you do a deep penetration you can get a baby boy if you are just shallow penetration it is a baby girl so this is not at 100% proven 50% this criteria also help for the gender detection mm, so this two methods you can try at your home for the baby okay but uh, one more thing i want to tell you whatever the baby is you just you just have the aim you just want a healthy happy baby at the time of delivery not you are just going to stress out for the baby girl or boy because if you are get the stress na you are not giving you can't give the deliver a happy healthy baby so whatever it may be if it is girl or it is boy just accept it and just uh, love it okay i hope you understand it what is the criteria because there are so many uh, oldies theories which say that if your baby bump is a very big you are going to deliver a baby boy vice versa if you are a shallow bump you are less bump you are going to deliver a baby girl if you are oh, so many vomitings you are hyper vomit uh, vomited then you are going to deliver a baby girl and uh, if you are not having vomiting then you are going to deliver a baby boy if you are like the sweets you are going to deliver a baby boy if you like uh, uh, what you can say if it like khatta and all then you can deliver a baby girl like these theories are which old is tales which are not that much proven or that is not scientific so these all theories are just a uh, fake theories so i hope you understand it and you will not rely on it because so many uh, magazines so many youtube criteria so many everybody is advertising for the baby boy and girl they are giving so many products for to deliver a boy or girl but that is not at all good that is just a fake things just to get money and uh, there is no any scientific can prove one so don't follow this all criteria and just make one aim to give a only healthy and happy baby and maybe boy or girl okay so i hope you understand my topic you like it you love it okay mm, another one thing what i am to tell you is uh, sex of the baby is uh, to determine it is a punishable act so please don't do it if you do it you are go- going to give a uh, give a you are going to get a very heavy punishment it is punishable act mtp act become very strong to it so please don't do guys okay mm. if you like my topic uh, share it subscribe it tab tab ke liye goodbye get well so okay bye